Well, my name is Deputy Luther. I'm the Recreation Deputy here at Dodge County. I've been here for about four years. Been doing the rec position for uh, a number of years now, and uh, we got snow, so it's a, it's a great opportunity for us to get out there, um, get some uh, quality time on the trails, make positive contacts with people, and uh, make sure everybody's doing the safe things on the trails. It's kind of unique here in Dodge County. We have our wild new state trail here, so it's actually open to ATV and UTV traffic as well during the winter times when it's cold enough. So, you know, that's one of the biggest thing I tell snowmobilers that are operating on this trail is to just be mindful you're gonna have ATV, UTVs that aren't necessarily designed to, you know, stay as far right as possible and they couldn't get stuck, but it's one of those things, you know, just be aware of it, go at those slower speeds, you know, when you have your headlights on, be able to see that. Um, and you know, just the biggest thing with that too is just staying as far right possible on the trail as you can. Um, Cause you get to these tight intersections, corners, stuff like that. If you're as far over as you can be, we're gonna limit those accidents. And that's the biggest thing. When you're going out on the trails on the snowmobile, it's always best to go with another snowmobiler um, and bring all the obvious necessities that you're gonna need, uh, a phone, an extra charger, um, things to stay warm, obviously. Um, let people know where you're going. So if you don't show up, you know, somebody knows. You know, alcohol and speed are one of the biggest factors that we have for a lot of our accidents throughout the state. Go slow, keep the speeds, don't override your abilities. You know, limit that alcohol consumption or just don't drink at all if you're gonna be out on the sled. The biggest thing is we just wanna limit that accidents throughout the state. And if everybody can be on board with the same mindset, I think that it can go a long way. These trails are a privilege because they're on a lot of property owners. It goes over a lot of their land. And we do see uh, on occasion where people go off the trails and we need to eliminate that completely. Um, we need people to stay on the trails so we can keep the trails uh, and keep this uh, relationship with the landowners that we have and with the snowmobile clubs as well. You know, we have a very unique uh, hotline system. You know, it gives anybody the ability to call in complaints. And you know, I stress that enough to, you know, if you see something, say something. Simple details, who, what, where, when, why. You see a specific machine, you know, try to give a decent description so we can kind of follow up as needed. And that's just gonna go a long ways with uh, the clubs, you know, even with the county and stuff too. It just helps us out because we can't be everywhere at once. So.